Hello you guys and welcome back to another Vivian Tries. Next item involves toothpaste. It's this press toothpaste. Oh my god, that name. <laughs> so is this thing. This one should be pretty easy. It says no electricity or batteries required. I think it just squeezes. You hang it on your wall. Obviously we're not hanging it up on the walls of my office, but we'll at least get the visual because this is pretty cool. I think this is pretty basic, All right? Okay, there's one piece. Here's the other piece. On the bottom, you have this little glue stuff that you can use to glue it to your wall. What is this? They threw in a toothbrush holder. I like it. This should be pretty easy, right? Open it up. It even has a piece of paper in there to display how your toothpaste should fit right in there. Okay, so we can take the paper out. Maybe not. It says here, important, you must prime the pump when installing a new toothpaste. What the? What do you mean prime? Let me take this off because I'm about to ruin this before I even use it for the first time. Okay, why you put all these instructions on here? I'm trying to use the product without reading instructions. Wait, hold on, I may need that sticker. Wait, let me put it back. Oh, we gotta put it, that's okay. It says to put a towel underneath here, I guess to catch whatever is about to come out, whatever, the toothpaste that's gonna come out. Then you want to raise the trigger and then squeeze. Oh, okay. I guess that's what they mean by prime. I, you have to squeeze the first bit of it out. Just guessing. Oh no, girl. You know how I do it here. Okay, let's open up this toothpaste. Do I need the little, do I need this, mom? <laughs> Good question. Vivid. Oh, wait. I'm wondering if I have to take this off. Yeah, you do, you do. I'm asking like you guys are talking to me, but I'm just going to do this. I hope this doesn't turn into a mess. What if my toothpaste seems like it's too big for that opening? It's in. Said so to lift this and then what? Okay, it just fell apart. I hope I can put it back. Okay, so to prime, let's squeeze some out ourselves, I think. I think that's what it means by priming. Okay, it's working. I think that's what priming means. Make sure it works. I think that's what that means. Okay, guys. Look at this. Look at me go. Oh my God. Wait, no, here, yes. Got him, got him. But that big old long toothpaste sure is ugly. It's not cute. Wait, this is a mess. I don't like it. This is too much work. Just squeeze the fucking toothpaste out with your hands, you lazy. Shit. Okay, wait, I, yeah, that's what I thought. I'm talking to myself. I forget that you guys are here. Okay, here we go. All right, I don't know what I was doing wrong a second ago. I think it's close. This is kind of silly sticking up like this. Why wouldn't they cover? I mean, if you're gonna make this little plastic thing, you might as well just make it all the way up. This wobbly little toothpaste hanging out there is kind of tacky and nobody wants tackiness. So, oh no, it keeps falling out guys. This is not staying in place. How it should work is that you're putting your toothbrush in there and obviously it's not gonna work because, okay, see this is silly because like it's getting pushed around. Okay, so I'm gonna have to do it like this. Like it's on the wall. You put your toothbrush in and you squeeze. Oh, there it is. It's out on my finger. That's your toothbrush. And then you brush your teeth. But that's not enough toothpaste, not even for a baby. That's like one freaking tooth. You squeeze, squeeze, nothing. What a piece of junk. What the hell's this? Who's brushing their teeth with that? It's not even enough for my dog. Guys, I'm gonna say all this, this is a piece of shit. I can't even talk. First of all, this wobbly ass thing keeps falling out and I understand it should be on the wall, but even if it was on the wall, I mean, it's like wobbly, number one. Number two is not enough toothpaste comes out. It says here it has a suction force pressure pad. No, it doesn't. It does not have a suction pressure pad force whatever it said. It doesn't work piece of junk. I don't even remember what I paid for this. It's a fail. It's a mess. Very cheap plasticky shit. It's worth $3.59. That's it. And again, here's another product that you should wait until it's at the dollar store for you to buy it. It's not worth paying the regular price for this. It's not even worth paying five bucks for this because it doesn't so if you really desperately want to try it, wait until it's at the dollar store, then buy it and then be disappointed. And then comment on this video and let me know that I was right.
All right, you guys, that is it for another Vivian Tries. I hope that you have enjoyed this video. If you have, give it a big fat thumbs up. I have had so much fun. For the most part, I was so impressed. All right, you guys, that is all that I have for you today. If you are new to the channel, subscribe. Don't forget to turn on notifications because you have to come back to watch if that lantern is still gonna be working after I freeze it and crack it open out of that piece of ice. Notifications on. If you've liked this video and you want to watch more, you should watch this video. If you want to watch all of my videos, click down here on this playlist. And you should definitely subscribe to my channel by clicking here. All right, you guys, that is all that I have for you today. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!